Who let the dogs in? Go with this hand. I will start teaching it. Take hands in your lines. Gents with gents. The ladies with the ladies. So we have a long line. Okay. Two long lines facing each other. And we start by dancing forward to that other line. And I'll count you in like this. Seven, two, three, and eight, two, three. And you start dancing forward. All right. Let's do that all together. Seven, two, three, and forward for two. Oh, well, one, two, three, and two. Back up. Three, two, three, and four. Drop those hands. You're going to pass through to the other side where your partner is standing. Actually, hold on a second. Point to your partner. Hopefully they're pointing back to you. You keep this partner throughout the stand. But you will move through the line. Progress up through the line and then back down to the bottom. Alright, so where they're standing, that's where you want to go in two bars. One, two, three, two, two, three. And to avoid crashing, you will pass the partner by right shoulder. So right shoulder to right shoulder. Alright, go! Five, two, three, six, turn around, seven, two, three, and eight, two, three. Now, we're going to do a setting step, and you're going to see people do weird things. That's fine. Um, if you don't know how to do a setting step, you can just walk, or you can jump. I probably won't do that because that takes the mic out of range. Um, and if you know a setting step, go ahead and do that. And setting step, and one, two, three, and two, two, three, three, two, three, and four, two, three. Cool. That was so much fun, we get to do it all over again. So take hands in lines. We're going to go that and do forward and back. Three, two, three, forward and back. Oh, one, two, three, two, back up. Three, two, three, drop hands, back through. Five, two, three, six, turn around, steady, step, and here we go. One, two, three, and two, two, three, three, two, three, and four, two, three. That's it for most of you for a good chunk of time. So, new definition. We have something called the first quarter. So whoever is the current top gent in each line and bottom lady, point to each other. So you are the first corner. When I say first corner, do a thing. You will approach each other in the middle and boy, you've got a long way to go. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> and you will do the thing and then you'll return home. Second corners are the top lady and bottom gent. Point to each other. Now. Everybody else gets to chill for a while and watch the first quarters and second quarters do things. But pay attention because you will eventually be a first quarter or a second, second quarter person. Alright. Um, in the meantime, we're going to demonstrate something. Actually, I think we have somebody at each line who can demonstrate. Uh, which is how to turn safely when you're screaming through the center at high speed trying to do these turns. Uh, so, actually, could you two demonstrate for our line how to turn safely with elbow turns? You're going to top your hand. We have no thumbs in daily because that generates claw action. And when you're turning by the elbow, you end up in your turn. So, keep those thumbs tightly against the index finger and go ahead and turn. And you just turn once and then you go back to where you came from. All right. So, actually, practice that with your current partner. Everybody go ahead and do that. So, turning. And while we're at it, practice turning by the left elbow, because you're going to do that too. Excellent. All right, now we get to see it in action with the first and second quarter. So, back to the dance itself. First quarter. Turn by the right elbow. So approach each other in the center. So go ahead and do that. One, two, three, two, two, three. Turn in the center and then rush on home. Three, two, three, and four, two, three. That's all the time you have. Oh my God, it's so far away. The second quarter will repeat the same thing. Turning by the right elbow, we'll do that. And five, two, three, six, two, three, seven, two, three, and eight, two, three. Ah, First quarter, you now get to turn by that left elbow. Go ahead and do that. And one, two, three. Two, two, three. Second quarter, same thing. Five, two, three. Six, two, three. Seven, two, three. And eight, two, three. All right. Now, teaching time again. We have something called a long swing. So, hmm, this is way too interesting. I'm going to suggest a slightly different long swing for people, which is you'll take cross hands with your, uh, let's practice it with our current partners. We don't do this during the dance, so let's do it for practice, for teaching purpose. Take cross hands with your partner, and just turn around each other, and turn and turn, kind of clockwise. And you'll be doing this in the center. There we go. And you can go as fast as you want, safely, or as slowly as sedately 
as you wish. There might be other forms of swings that you'll see, but that's the one. If you don't know how to do a swing, if you've not done it before, that's the one we want you to use, the crosshand swing. Again, it'll happen in the center, and it'll be that. So, back to the dance. The first corners will turn, will swing in the center. So go ahead, approach each other, take those cross hands, and swing in the center. One, two, three. It's a long swing. Three, two, three. No, keep swinging. Three, two, three. Four, two, three. Five, two, three. Six. I'll say, go home. That's when you get to go home. Seven, two, three, and eight, two, three. Second corners get to do the same thing. And one, two, three. Two, two, three. Three, two, three. Four, two, three. Five, two, three. Six, we go home. Seven, two, three, and eight, two, three. Now, everyone has to wake up. The top couple is going to visit everybody in the opposite line in turn. The second person all the way down to the last person in each line. So we all have to be ready for it. In fact, everybody else in the line, take your right hand and put it in your pocket or put it behind your back. You're not going to need it for this part at all. It's only your left. Oh, are you guys good? You can't say it's all the drifting. Ah, okay. We don't exactly have much room on the side either, so we're going to be a bit tight. Friendly. Friendly, I like it. So, top couple. You will turn your partner once and a half to switch sides and approach that other line. Turn that top person by the left elbow. Back into the center with your partner by the right. Next person by the left. No, no, no. Nobody else moves. Nobody else moves. To clarify, only the top couple is moving down the line. Everybody else stays in place. Oh, we have a long line down here. All right, eventually our line will make it to the bottom, at which point you go back up to the top, top couple. However you want to do it, yes, you can do a polka, you can walk up, it doesn't matter. Just get back up to the top. And on your own, on your original side. Now, they're going to peel off something called a cast off. They're going to turn and go to the bottom. We play follow the leader, so follow them. Follow them. In your own line. And, oh, and boy, line urges. Good luck. Now, when you make it to the bottom, you're going, they're going to form an arch. You go under that arch with your partner. All the way to the top. There you go. And by the magic of Kaylee, the top couple has become the bottom couple. We have new top couples, new first quarters, new second quarters, and the dance starts all over again. We'll do that a lot tonight. All right, let's rewind it because we practiced it one time with the original top couples and top couple. We will not rewind when the music starts. We're just going to keep going, so be prepared for that. And I'm sure we can move. It started with the hands in line.
Oh, 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 oh,